Haji Mukisa Karim omusomi wedua akola kusonga izenja uli. Ononye zemiri mjiganyi, business zoko la zizifwa, oyagala visa eganye, sende zofu na ziziku hita mungalo. Esonga zona Haji Mukisa Karim ya azimala. Eyandi muetaze mfune kunamba yesimu 0 msambu msambu mnana, chenda mubiri, chenda muemu, ana muemu. Haji Mukisa Karim omusomi wedua. Well, a very good morning. Welcome to the Buzz UG. My name is uh, Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fula. Uh, don't forget to subscribe in case you haven't. And also tap on uh, the bell for all the notifications. And of course, uh, the big man is uh, Haj Mukisa Karim Omsomi Wedua. Call him on that number on your screen right there and uh, he will get everything sorted. <laughs> now, the biggest story trending right about now in the media is about uh, Jeno Kale Kaihura. Now, President Museveni, who doubles as uh, the Commander-in-Chief of uh, the Armed Forces, has approved the retirement of uh, 110 UPDF soldiers in a ceremony slated for August 31st this year. According to a statement signed by the spokesperson of uh, UPDF, that is uh, Brigadier General Felix Kulaije, of uh, the 110 UPDF officers to retire, 11 are generals and uh, 99 are senior officers. Batch 13A of uh, those to retire includes former IGP, that is uh, General Kale Kaihura, according to UPDF. Now, the former Inspector General of Police, uh, that is uh, General Kale Kaihura, was in 2018 charged with a failure to protect war materials, a failure to supervise police officers, and a betting kidnap. He has been out on bail since 2020. Well, additionally, General Kale Kaihura was in 2018 sacked from uh, the position of IGP, which he held for over 12 years. He was uh, replaced by his then deputy, that is uh, Martin Okotho Chola. Other retiring generals include uh, Joseph Arocha, uh, Stephen Oluka, and uh, Ham Atochi Kaija, among others. Well, there you go. Uh, that is uh, the information coming from uh, General Kale Kaihura's camp. And uh, I have seen uh, the supporters of uh, General Mohozi Kainerugaba on uh, different social media platforms complaining uh, that um, why hasn't uh, President Museveni included General Mohozi Kainerugaba on uh, the list of uh, those to retire from uh, the UPDF because uh, they are expecting him to retire uh, preparing for 2026 presidential elections. Yes, yeah, so uh, supporters of uh, General Mohozi Kainerugaba are not happy that he's not among the people slated to retire on the 31st of August. Uh, this very very year but yeah uh, that is uh, the latest update coming from uh, that side of uh, the UPDF and um, when I get more details on uh, this story I'll be keeping you posted right here on the Buzz UG now away from that uh, FUFA president and uh, Budiope East member of parliament that is Horebo Moses Magogo and his wife Della Dora Sally have welcomed a baby girl to their family uh, sharing the news on her social media platforms, Dora revealed that uh, the adorable band of joy is now one month old. She expressed the immense happiness the little one has brought to their family. Uh, it should be remembered that uh, Dora introduced horrible Magogo to her parents in a lavish ceremony back in uh, 2017. Now, with the arrival of uh, their baby girl, uh, they now have three children comprising of a boy and uh, two girls. Well, it should also be remembered that uh, Magogo is uh, officially married to the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Monk, and uh, their marriage was uh, formalized. That was uh, last year, 2022. You also remember the Speaker of Parliament bought for Horrible Magogo on his birthday a brand new Range Rover. Oh my God, you remember that jazz? It was a big one on social media platforms. Uh, the Speaker of Parliament uh, bought, uh, you know, Horrible Moses Magogo, a brand new Range Rover, as you can see it right there, black in color, brand new. <laughs> I don't know how the Speaker of Parliament is feeling about this news, but uh, uh, that is uh, the latest coming from uh, that side of uh, uh, Horrible Moses Magogo. And uh, I remember last year there was uh, a topic, a big topic on social media, and uh, people were saying that uh, women should also learn to invest in their men. Uh, if the Speaker of Parliament can do it, anyone can do it. Yeah, you can also invest in your man. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing can stop you from buying your man a brand new Range Rover, you know. But anyway, that is uh, the latest coming in from uh, that side. And uh, uh, we wish them all the best. 
Well, coming in from uh, the entertainment industry, there are reports that uh, Alien Skin is uh, actually uh, preparing to work with uh, Diamond Platinums from uh, Tanzania. I haven't really confirmed these reports, but I have seen them circulating so big time on uh, different social media platforms that a collab between Alien Skin and uh, Diamond Platinums is in the pipeline. But of course, uh, uh, I'm still waiting to confirm this. Uh, I don't know how to this information is. And uh, when I finally confirm it, I'll keep you posted right here on uh, the Buzz UG. But I know uh, Diamond Platinums is coming in Uganda very soon. Yes, yeah, so uh, maybe uh, they'll, they'll be working on uh, that collab when he's uh, right here. But uh, we're waiting to confirm uh, this story and I'll be keeping you posted right here on uh, the Buzz UG. My name is uh, Melaz Milo, a.k.a. Fula. Don't forget to subscribe in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Uh, contact my big man, Haji Mukisa Karimo Msomi Wedua. And uh, man, he will get everything sorted. Haji Mukisa Karim, umsomi wedua, akola kusonga izenja uli. Onunye zemiri mjiganyi, business zoko la zizifwa, oyagala visa e ganyi, sende zofu na ziziku hita mungalo. Esonga zona, Haji Mukisa Karim, ya azimala. E yandi mwetaze, mfune kunamba yesimu, zero msambu msambu mnana, chenda mubiri, chenda muemu, ana muemu. Haji Mukisa Karim, umsomi wedua.